their mind what they're going to do, right? That's what I'm saying. Okay. Now I want to address something real quick, and then we'll pass it along. Um, I'm a. I guess it's pronounced Nasa or um, Yo Yochiv. Well, I don't know how to pronounce it because it's probably not pronounced that way. But <laughs> she she asked a question. She said, "Why don't y'all hold black men accountable? If you can change, probably meant the majority of black men to be productive and successful, that will automatically change the women. Women will follow." Oh God. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm gonna address it. Look, uh, Nasa, you are very much uninformed. Okay, you are an uninformed woman. The men are mainly productive men. How do you become a productive man in America? Once you finish high school and you're 18 years old and you can go do what you want to do, a productive man is going to either go to college or some type of trade school, or he's going to either he's going to uh, go to the military. He'll go get a job or he'll go start a business. Most black men are already doing that, period. Okay, so what you're saying doesn't match reality. Most of them are well, what, what they're doing, Roger, is they're lying Amen. because women have free choice. When no. Women have women have free. You know, we you 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 Christians. I'm 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 not a Christian, so I, I'll defer to you in in this regard, mm -hmm. in that regard. But my understanding of Christianity is that you have free choice. If God gives you free choice to choose him or not him or whatever, then he certainly gives you free choice as to whether or not you choose to operate with a productive man. And what women like her uh, fallaciously assert is that they pretend as though women do not have free choice. And the truth of the matter is women very often choose lesser men. They enjoy choosing lesser men for their own personal, venal, mercenary, arrogant, hubris, for, for whatever reason, whether you know they want to get some baby and they don't want him to be in the picture or they want to manipulate the governmental system or for, for all kinds of reasons, women choose to. Point. They, well, exactly. Well, no, no. It's, it's not. But, 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 but I, I want to emphasize this point more than anything else to all the women who listen to, to this, not just her, but all the women. We know that you have free choice. You cannot fool the men here. You cannot deceive the men here into thinking that if they do whatever, you're going to fall in line. That's a right. lie. That's a yep. fundamental lie. Yep. Understand exactly. that is a lie. Do not yep. embrace this notion that if you as a man do everything possibly perfect, you're fucking Michael B. Jordan, for example. We've talked about that recently. You do everything right. You do, or you're a fucking nuclear physicist, right? Did, did mm -hmm. being a nuclear physicist Help that brother in terms of dealing with that woman. No, he he don't tickle my pussy. So that's a lie. B black men, Eidos men could do everything right, and you all can still choose to do some fucked up shit that has nothing at all to do with what black men choose to do. And you yeah. men better know that, and you all need to <clears throat> assert that to them. Because what they do is... They attempt to try to guilt trip you all into believing this type of shit that she's presenting. That if you work your ass to the bone 70, 80 fucking hours a week doing everything possibly right, that she may at that point decide that she's going to be a somewhat decent woman. Do not believe that. Do not embrace that. Well, well I was definitely going go to go there as well. But one of the things I, I, I want to have it brought out. Because I want people to understand just how simple this is. In America, there's only four choices to be a productive man. You go to college or you go to the trade school. Once you hit 18 years old and you and you leave high school. Or you're going to the military. Or you're going to get a job. Or you're going to start a business. There's literally no other choice. You but can but make whether you man. are a productive man, Roger, has nothing to do with the no, no, choices no, no. that she makes. No, I, I, and I, I, I'm man. just saying... I. I was getting this there. Is, I was getting there. I was yeah. getting there, Black. Okay. What 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 I'm what I'm trying what I'm what I want to be known, because this is something people can go check out and verify for themselves. 
if you talk to women and what they're doing and who they're having children with, they're not doing it with the men doing the productive choices. Most of them are not doing that. Yes, you can find some doing that, but most of them are not doing it. They're not choosing to marry men who made the productive choice. They're not choosing to have children with the men who made the productive choice. They're not choosing to be led by men who made the productive choice. Now, women have their own brains. So when she says women will follow strong men, yes, women of other groups will follow strong men. But from a majority standpoint, when it comes to black women, especially ones here in America, because I'm not an expert in other people's country, but y'all have mm. proven you won't. So that's no. what makes well, they, it they, Well, hold on. Let's be specific. They won't follow strong black men. Let's, let's be specific. Absolutely. They may Absolutely. follow a strong white guy. Hell, they may follow a strong Latina guy, Asian guy. I don't really give a fuck. But we know, we have hard evidence that they will not follow a strong black guy. Most of them will not do that. And, and Nace, I'm not, this is not to attack you because I don't even know you. This is my first time you've noticed you in the chat. But the point is, what you're saying is 100% wrong. The data is already in, the proof is already there. This is an absolute lie. Okay. You may not be informed that it's a lie, but it is an absolute lie. Y'all follow who you want to at the end of the day. And you, and black women have shown. By their preference, they don't choose to follow strong black men. And that is no one's fault but their own. Point blank, period. Now, I got to get my man perfect in here. Uh, well, AL, did you have an open statement? Because you said something, but well, you got another open statement to make? I want to skip you. Okay, AL, you there? Okay, AL may have stepped away. Perfect, you got it, brother. <laughs> 